Hey, how's it going? Drew here. I just wanted to make another a video for you folks. If you're a content creator, entrepreneur, business owner especially, you will definitely want to check this video out. So I'm gonna be making a tutorial video. I'm gonna be editing it soon on how you make, um, I don't know the proper name for it, but a social media video. We've all seen it. You and I have all seen it. It's a video where uh, it's like a square, usually square. You have the bars on top and bottom, the videos in the, in the center, right? You have your headline on top, and then you have your captions, your subtitles on the bottom, right? So how do you make these videos? Are they really hard? You need to hire an editor to do it? Uh, all that stuff, right? So actually, you can do it for free, and actually they're not, they're a little time consuming, but not too hard to put out, especially if you batch it. You start with like something simple, like a frequently asked questions, something uh, like a common concern that you get in your industry, in your field, right? So for example, for a realtor, for example, like it might be, you know, maybe if someone's selling their home, they might, ask you like, where do I go? What website do you recommend I go to get all the paperwork, get all the stuff ready to, to be prepared to sell my home? So you could do a video on that, you know, or you could be a chiropractor and educating on like, what do you expect before you arrive to your first chiropractic appointment? And so just certain things like that or concerns or it could even be objections, like common objections you may hear uh, in your, in your line of work. So you can address these in these short little videos and because it's formatted with the headline and the subtitles. And the reason you do that is really important on virtually every social media thing that there is, especially Instagram, especially LinkedIn, uh, pretty much all of them nowadays. Uh, when you are scrolling through videos and like your newsfeed, the, videos obviously are going to be muted and if you have subtitles right the subtitles at least on like YouTube they'll automatically start playing but if you bake the subtitles in your video like in the social media videos and I'll show you how to do that then when you burn them in the video then you're no matter what platform you're on the when people are scrolling through and they see your video they'll be able to, without even listening to you, they'll be able to follow along. And if they're interested, then they'll uh, click on your video and it will play it with sound, right? So that is why subtitles are so important. And then also subtitles are important for SEO purposes. If you're planning to put your video on YouTube or what have you, YouTube's the big one because it's uh, the little brother to, to Google, right? So. It's just really, really important to do the subtitles and stuff. It's really good for attention grabbing. And once you get the system down, it's, it's not too crazy. It's, it's pretty straightforward.